pretty a fair amount. She's a little bit offended at you trying to barter more off of her. She's looking at you a little bit like, oh, I thought you were nice, giving me wine. I am nice. Can she just the throw wine the wine bottle just back just at Cade? Spit the wine, not the bottle. No, throw, smash the bottle over his head. <laughs> could, could I just say, just before Cade ruins this deal for us, I'll take the deal. No, no, no. no you am taking my deal. Oh, my no, deal. Didn't you go I... with Sawn to get a place? Or... Oh, no, no. Sawn went on his own, didn't he? Yeah. yeah. Okay, my apologies. Well, okay. In the interest of... of friendliness, I'll take the deal. Uh, what? Um... In the interest of friendliness? Yeah, mate. So, so, reduce your uh, wealth by 30 marks. Okay. Let's just say Mads looks over with um, a displeased look on his face because he doesn't agree with Kay's behaviour. Kay doesn't care. How, how much do they weigh, the three healing salves? Uh, depends. Uh, they are in total three quarters. Three quarters of a pound. pound. Yeah. Right. Okay. Was that so? They're, they're, each one is a quarter of a pound. Yes. They are costly. And what do they? What do they do exactly? Just prevent infection. No, they heal you. I just had to word it correctly. Over time. Or just on the spot. Um. In which case, I douse myself. I, I'm just saying. Why are you asking me? I uh, no. I'm asking the woman. Oh, she okay. she goes. Well, you apply it at regular intervals, probably about an hour or so, onto the you know onto your wounded area, and it will uh help your healing process. Didn't answer my question, but okay. Julian rubbed his butt with his Well, he's not going to tell you about her. Yeah, I just told you, regular intervals, about an hour. You can apply okay. more than that if you want to try it, but... No, it's fine. Um, I'm done. Enjoy that bottle of wine, miss. I will, thank you. I'll have what he had. <laughs> you ain't having it. What, you want to buy th two off of her and get a free one? She looks at you and goes, look, I, I gave the offer to one person, I can't do it again. It just put me too much out of business. Too much out of pocket, I'm afraid, I'm sorry. I approach her and say, I'll just take the tea for 30, please. Yep, she nods to you and says, there you go. And she hands it over. Thank you. Thank I'd have two for 30 as well. Okay. I look at Mads. What are you laughing at? No, sorry, it's completely irrelevant to the game, I'm sorry. What is this game you're on about? Well, what is this game? The game of houses, I heard of it once. What is this game of houses you speak of? On my travels through K here, the game of houses. Tree killers! Evil people. You associate well, with such people? I don't associate with such people. I sell to them. I take their money. Oh, good. That's, that's fine. <laughs> take from them. Take your fifth. <laughs> I take more than a fifth, my friend. What? Can't right, bother. And I um, run off to go catch up with Sorn. Yeah, I follow him. You can keep up. <laughs> I parkour through the through the branches. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> uh Mads are you going with them? Yeah. Alright then, so Uh yeah, the route that will bring you 
to the false dragon through the city has been public knowledge uh, often discussed for the past few days. The fact you haven't overheard it is quite surprising. Uh, yeah, there's a small square just inside the new city where you will probably get a fine view. And as you approach the square, you can see a dense crowd already pressing uh, the line of red cloaked pikemen who keep the street itself clear. You can see Sorn uh, standing up some steps that would lead to like the upper floor of a house, and he's managed to clear a space for you. Oh, I was going to say, are there any roofs uh, clear, like overlooking the. You're more than welcome to try and climb onto a roof. Yeah. Yeah, I'll try that. Uh, so what we gotta do? Just uh, D twenty plus my bonus. Go. So yeah, that's me climbing onto a roof. Okay. Just give me one second. With a bit less grace than the last climb that I did. Well, you backflipped over everything. <laughs> See this six foot hedge? Yeah, backflip. <laughs> what's your What's your bonus on climb? Do a bonus. I was, I was kind of talking to Thor. Plus yeah, six. Yeah, it's six, that's why he gets plus six. I thought we was capped at plus four for level one. Uh, you can add four and then it says agility bonus or strength bonus added extra. Yeah. Oh, right. Add dex. Oh. oh, so you're you're plus four under the skills then? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's oh, right, I'll have plus five. Then. Woo! I did that. Dude, no, it should all be already be written there. He can't. He should do. have your. Um, Bonus plus As you're light. climbing up, you hear a man shout, Oi, what are you doing? Get off that house! And a couple of people start looking all towards right, you. Right, I, bail, I, I, bail. I, uh, go down again, yeah. <laughs> what? Uh, are you? Fine. I've never heard of a cowardly are you. Huh? No, but there, there's a time and a place to fight. About yeah. three people raised crossbows at you as you started, as they, you were spotted. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I do not wish to engage on them. I have no qualm with them. I'm just merely trying to get a good view, and I can see from where I am. I was just looking for a better one, so there is no need to. Uh, so sorry. Continue. Describe our surroundings again. Um, imagine a long street. Actually, mm -hmm. I have a. Uh, I have something specifically for this. He's made a wonderful drawing. No, I haven't. But I'm going to make a wonderful drawing. <laughs> Live speed art. Let's do this. <laughs> the art attack. It's just a black screen. Oh, there we go. Oh, I like it, yeah. This is good anyway. Yeah. There we go. Mm -hmm. uh, ba -ba -ba. It, that were perfect. Perfect. Okay, so this is the road. Then there's. Uh, ignore the overlaps and all of that. It's basically strings yeah, of houses. What we can't see is the other side where this looks. While you're drawing this, yes. yes. Um, okay, so you decided to leave Roshanti behind, Rokinanto even. Well, I'm pretty sure she wouldn't like being in a crowded place for too long. Okay. I quickly get out a mobile phone and call the innkeeper and tell her to tell him to slaughter Rokinanto. <laughs> you realise that mobile phone new race rage. You realise that mobile phones haven't been invented yet, and you lose. Uh, Is that made you lose with two hit. Specific, you lose two hit points. With yeah, specific yeah, yeah, yeah. orders to leave Rokinanto's head in the bed that Julian was staying in. A phone appears in your hand. <laughs> um, you can't drag and drop your own characters, can you? Nope. Uh, we can if we can see him. You yeah. can in the journal. No, 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 drag and drop from the side menu. Oh, no. Oh, wait, he's not here. Uh, where? Where am I? You're there. Who am I? Oh, there we go. Okay, so yeah, you are... all, all healed. Uh, no, can you all reduce your health to what it should be? You're all over here. So you've come down from this area here. Mm -hmm. If I do an arrow, you've come down from here. 
And oh. on this building on the corner, by Sawn, is some stairs, and you're kind of at the top of the stairs looking down at the road. So we can, Where, see. Which so we can way? see clearly. Yeah, so you can see over the crowd. Okay, Wh which way is the dragon coming from? Can I, can I ask someone? You can ask someone, yeah. Um, there's no one around. <laughs> yeah, there's no, there, there's, there's, it's very busy. I just haven't kicked the crowd. I walk, I walk through the crowd, um, and the first man I see, I ask, which way is he coming from? Which way is the dragon coming from? He goes, hurt. What's it worth to you? Go away. <laughs> he just shakes his can head. I, and... Can I look for the nearest elderly woman and ask how long? Does she think until the parade will start? Um, can you please make a spot check? Okay, hold on. Uh, actually, no, know. actually, what is your spot? Sorry, I, I rolled it for you. But what is it? <laughs> um, it, I've got plus two on my spot. Okay, you don't find an elderly woman, but you find a group of women nat nattering around across the. Uh, the road roughly where your sprite is now. Alright. What, on the other side of the road? Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to quickly dash across, approach them, and ask them. They go, I don't know. We told it would start fairly early, midday. When it comes, it comes. Okay, I'll dash across back. Uh, what, what. Is it wilderness law that I'd need to use to tell how high in the sky the sun is? I like it. Uh, I'm going to say yes. I'm going to have a quick check, though. Meanwhile, I look at my my clockwork watch. Like, as in, check the shadows of everyone, see which way it's leaning kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. I just uh, hold my spear up. Uh, wilderness oh, law is keeping yourself alive in the wild. I'm going to say that's going to be a knowledge nature, I think. I'm just double checking. Is there a sundial somewhere around here? Well, no, no. It, it, it come under wilderness law, because knowing when to venture and when not to, according yeah, to the that's sun. That's knowledge yeah. nature. The seasons, cycles, weather. All of that. Yeah. Okay, well, so you want a nature knowledge. Okay. Oh, for fuck's sake. The sunlight hurts your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... What are you going to do? Um, uh, Mads, how long did the, did the woman tell you it would take before it started? Uh, they said it would be roughly about midday, so... Um, I walk around looking for a sundial. Can I perform a spot check or something? To spot you one? can say how far are you willing to walk? Um, I don't know, to the end of the street, maybe. <laughs> but I don't know, because I don't know how big the street is and and what is on either side of it. I don't know. There's a town square or whatever, because I know there'd be one at a town square, maybe, because there's usually is at cities. Well, let's put it this way. Um, the town square where you're meant to be seeing him is about this area here. I've just oh, drawn it like well, this for ease. Fair enough. I walk over to the town square because of my because um, my common knowledge. I, I know that there, might, there will probably be a sun out there. Uh, as you walk forward, you realise there's a massive crowd of people being held back by a line of pikemen keeping the square empty of people. Hey, hey, what's going on here? We have huh? Oh, you're asking. Asked. We're keeping everyone back from the square because of the parade coming through. I just want to know the time. Yeah, look at the sun. The sun's up there. If there's a sundial right next to you, can you please tell me the time? You don't know that there is. Oh. Well, you're pretty. He's pretty certain that there is. I'm pretty certain that there is. I make. You can a ask him to tell you if there is one. <laughs> I ain't telling you nothing or nothing. I've been told not to talk to the people in the crowd, so back off. <laughs> he's doing a good job. I love how he's um, a peasant from Walker Off Road. Work, work. Well, work. Yes, I'd like to point out something. 
Because Still I know happens. you're all very new to uh, to this sort of thing. I'm a game master. All you have to say is, we wait until thingy happens. No, 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 because I want to see if I can do something before the parade happens. Oh, yeah, so okay. That's why I'm asking. Okay. Basically, alright, so the guy doesn't want to help me. What if I give you a few coppers? Will you tell me the time then? Uh, the guards next to him say, you're going to have to give some to us on either side, and then it kind of does a chain, and they start paying more attention to you. I'll give five coppers to the first man that tells me the time. <laughs> they all just look blankly at you. <laughs> Ten. They, they all just look blankly at you, and one of them goes, uh, we're a unit. Well, I'm a single man, so what's that supposed to mean? I think a lady. <laughs> we work together. We get paid together. <laughs> I'm not <telling> you <laughs> uh, Well, they don't want to help me out. I go back. Fine, we'll just fucking wait. Uh, uh, yeah, as you as you head back. <laughs> Excuse me. Wait a sec. As you head, as you walk. So what? You're gonna head? Are you gonna rejoin the group? Yeah, yeah. dejected. Okay. Back. As you walk back, a, a little boy goes. Look, I, I I saw the dial earlier. I can tell you for ten coppers. Yeah, if he saw the dial earlier, though, it's gonna be different now, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. No, like he saw through the people. He saw. He How saw the ago? dial. How long ago did you see? I don't know, like five minutes, just now. While you were talking to the guards, he was standing behind you. Okay, and uh, what did it say, little boy? No, 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 no. Shush. I bend down. And look at him menacingly. You just lie to me now, or would you? What, why would I lie? You offered ten coppers. I did. So if I found out you lied, I'm taking it back. Da, da, da. <laughs> That's fine, sir. I'm not lying to you. With interest. Hand on my heart, sir. Can I just push Kate out of the way and say, what was the time, little boy? Please? No, you can't. No, you can't. Because I'm in front of you. And also, you're okay. still back there. There's a massive crowd of people between you. Oh, what? Is he still over at the square? Yeah, as he was heading back. Oh, God. Julian, just get the time off the bloke. <laughs> I'm having fun. I'm um, just going to perch and just show off on my blade and wait for the thing. Yeah, no, that's, that's, we're, we're more than happy to sit and wait for the, yeah. whilst okay. laughing at okay, Kane's boy. poor attempts at finding out the time. <laughs> yeah, man, it's fun. Okay, boy, here's ten coppers. Tell me the time. He goes, it's about midday, and then he runs off, and about... As you watch him running, like starting to run off, you hear horns in the background, initiating the start of the parade. I contemplate, I contemplate throwing a dagger at the boy's back, then put it away. No one spots this. <laughs> Everyone makes a spot check. They guarantee to make it. Um, the guards that you were near don't actually notice. <laughs> Did you actually make a spot? Check? Oh yeah. Oh, you just pulled a God. knife out in a crowd. I'm not. I'm gonna make people notice stuff like that. But anyway, yeah. So you notice. So in general, here we go. Uh, da, 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 da. A disturbance in the turbulent throng catches your attention, and you see a gap appearing in the crowd, and four men emerge. Ga uh, yeah. So basically, you've rejoined with the group, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So four men emerge, uh, glaring at onlookers who part before them. They're heavily armoured, wearing gleaming mail and white cloaks of p with a p uh, pure white golden line and a, uh, pure white cloaks with a golden sunburst pattern. The okay. leaders yeah. augment, uh, augmented with a silver lightning flash emblem. Wait. You there? The leader calls out, pointing towards your group as they approach. They make their way through the parting crowd and continue to shoot sus uh, suspicious glances at those around you. I cower in fear. A few feet away, the group halts and the leader looks at you up and down. We're looking for a group of backcountry bumpkin dark friends all. Uh, you certainly have the look. And the crowd, like, you're up on the stairs, but the crowd near you starts to part away slowly. So, that you know, so it's kind of obvious that you're there and they're there. And there's like a crowd, a gap, basically. Right, okay. I have no idea what insult you just flung at me, so you're gonna have to translate it. He called he yeah. called you a backcountry bumpkin and and a dark friend. I still don't know what they are. A dark friend is, um, how do I put this? A worshipper of uh, Satan. I think um, think 
Worm Tongue. Okay. Yeah, okay, Worm Tongues are probably a better shout. Uh, back Country, so Hillbilly, and I'm not entirely sure what a bumpkin is. Idiot. Yeah, idiot. an idiot. So he called you a, a Back Country idiot. Please, sir, I don't know no dark friends. I'm not a dark friend, I swear to God, I'm not, I'm not. Oh, and I can't dark friend. We're not the people you're looking for. <laughs> Yeah. I say with a bit make, of make, make confusion on my face. Uh, <laughs> uh, the o the officer walks up to you, seeing as you're the one that actually responded, and he goes, "What is your name, child? I and tell me, Conan. do you walk in the light?" And I do. And where are you all from? Because two of you have the look of someone I'm looking for. You know, you have the appearance of someone I'm looking for. Um, I hail from a small town. In the Midlands, not far from here. And that at town would be? Um, hold on one second. Uh, Little Orchid. He just nods and goes, fair enough. And you? And he looks at Sorin, uh, Sorn. I say, uh, I am Sorn of uh, the Black Rock Sept. And what sort of place is that? A place of men. It sounds. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. I'm just gonna have to process that for a second. <laughs> <laughs> I've never heard of it before. Pray you aren't lying to me. What, what need would I have to lie? I don't know. You dark friends are all alike. Lying through your teeth. Lying is for the weak. Do I look weak? Well, you bear no emblem to show you are one with the children, and all who are who don't follow in the light are weak. Weak of spirit, weak of mind. Where are the people you are looking for from? They hail from the two rivers. Neither of my, uh, none of my companions are from there, I can assure you of that. And what proof do I have? You know, what proof do you have to back up your claims? Well, I'm... I'm the colour of our skin. <laughs> yeah. We know that end of the world case. Well, I was, I was born in Whitebridge, but I haven't been there in years. How, how would we be able to prove where we are from anyway? How can you prove where you're not from? Right, right. Just, just as a legitimate um, thing. Game. The person. No, 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 no. Just, just as a leg, like a legit out of game thing here. How literally would they be able to prove? Yeah. Because it's I like how walk around with passports. Yeah. yeah. Guys, you have to realise that these guys are trying to promote, uh, provoke a fight. Yeah. They oh, are. okay. Fair like, enough. Out of, out of game thing right now. These are. Can I tell them what they are then? Yeah. These are white cloaks. They're basically. Uh, they basically hunt anyone who they think is a dark friend or an Aes Sedai. They think they're yeah. witches and bad. These are they're like the Catholic Church back in the Dark Ages. Think that. Right. Religious well, fanatics who think everyone else is beneath them. I basically say to the guy, "We're not who you're looking for, so we'll just go about our business, and you go about yours." And I, what? Um, can I? Is, if I if I perform a knowledge check like a local one, mm -hmm. um, can I find out who they are? You can. Um, yeah, I perform it. Twenty. Do I know who they yeah, are? Yeah, you know that they're the white part. Of, yeah, part of the local white cloak. Organ. Okay, so I walk up to them and go, "Excuse me, but you don't actually have any jurisdiction here." Last I checked. We have jurisdiction wherever there's light. Are you saying that this oh. area is full of darkness? Okay, okay, you have jurisdiction of light, but legally speaking, you can't set, do anything to us, so if you don't mind, we're trying to watch the parade. I like it, I like that, actually. That's, that's, that's so the, good. To that, that was very good, so uh, I'm going to remember that. But as you are doing this, with the big commotion, a couple of the guards come up and say, they're right, you four need to move along. And stop pestering like people that are watching the parade. Oh, me. And uh, they look at each other, 
and they notice that there's a lot of guards around paying attention to this and they go all right and then as they're walking away they just look at the four of you and go walk in the light you know stay in the light yeah yeah don't let the light hit you <laughs> <laughs> they would love it if the light hit them all right <laughs> yeah. the broke then as well, I know, so. I know. <laughs> the, the whole time I was just thinking crazy. Okay then, well, Pretty this long. is a fairly decent spot to have a 10 second or a 2 minute break. Yep, so uh, yep. we'll be back in a second. <laughs>